absolutely stunning morning out behind me. Uh, obviously, it's still a bit dark, but I've got something new in line for you guys today. Something I haven't done. So, um, for Christmas, splashed out and bought myself a kayak. Um, now, it's not an amazing kayak. I just got it from the warehouse. It's pretty much to get me around the rocks and into some more, you know, just uh, untouched locations land base wise. But today, this morning, it's dead flat. Uh, it was blowing westerly offshore. Um, so I thought, why not put the kayak in the water, take a couple of soft bait rods, uh, launch off one of the beaches in the Coromandel, and just slowly make my way up the coast, peppering the shallow stuff and see if we can drag a big snapper out on the soft bait. So I'm just sitting here, I'm just waiting for the sun to come up a bit so you guys can see what's going on, but it's an unreal sunrise. But I think what I might do is just get the uh, kayak in the water and start my little mission out. I think looking into into the light, you guys can see a little bit of what's going on anyway. So um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll drag the kayak out, we'll get into it, eh? See you out there. All right, people, I was just heading across to where I wanted to start soft baiting. I've obviously had a few flicks this morning, uh, a few little nibs and things like that, but nothing too crazy. Um, but one of the bays that I was thinking about throwing a few soft baits around, um, as I went past it, then I decided, nah, I'll just carry on straight over. I had a look in there just now, and there's something blowing up fish on the surface, so I'm just heading, heading in there. Um, I just lost my soft bait hook uh, in the weed, so I'll get in here and I'll retie. It's not a big bay, this one, but I know there can be some good snaps in here, so we'll, uh, we'll sneak in here and have a few flicks, and then we'll head down to the main spot where hopefully we do some damage today. As you can see, I'm not wearing a life jacket. I left it in the car and didn't realize until I was bloody halfway to where I am now. So um, yeah, don't um, don't be like me and not wear a life jacket, right? Um, all right, haven't seen any more fish bust up, but we'll sneak in here. It'll definitely be worth the prospect anyway. So I'll, um, I'll retie my jig head and, um, and we'll get into it. On. On the drop. Nothing big, but snappery. First one for the kayak, so not complaining. First fish of the morning. Definitely nothing to write home about, but we're on the board, peeps. Look at that. Mean. See you, mate. On. So I went into that bay, got that one snap. Now I'm into the bay that I was coming to fish. Second cast in, nice little panty, pulling the kayak around a bit. It's gonna be exciting if I get a good one on. Oh, got a bit of dang dang this fish. And we're only at the very start of the bay as well. I just thought I'd start at the bay and cruise my way through and uh, yeah, there's fish biting. It's a nice snap. Come here, mate. Yeah, pull me around for my next cast, thank you. Yeah, happy with that. Through here, right in the shallows. Oh, it's a good fish, it's a good eating fish, but um, I'm here to just catch, catch them for fun, so yeah. Oh, he's shitting all over me. Nice penny, hooked in the corner of the mouth. Oh, that's a stinky shit, mate, thank you. Have a good one. Thank you. Yuck. Thanks for shitting. All right. So I'm just using the Z-Man 7-inch bubble gum on a TT38 jig head, 20 pound trays. 20 pound uh, main line. All right. Getting a few wax out here. It's kind of like sandy, kind of rubbly on the bottom. Not very deep, probably like three meters deep. Oh. 
Oh. On. On on the little bait caster. Overhead soft bait. It's a little car wire, I think. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a mongrel. Get out. Oh, I'm not about this life. Oh, you're the perfect livey too. Obviously, didn't bring any kingy gear. I don't know how I'd go. This isn't really a kayak for fishing, so I don't know how hanging onto a big kingy would go here. Um, so I didn't bring any kingy gear, and it's quite a good spot to catch them. Behave yourself, mate. Behave yourself. Oh, you would be the ultimate livey too. This is more the area where I like to fish through here. To be honest, I'm probably going to get off this light gear. So this is eight pound on this little overhead soft bait rod combo. Um, but I don't want to start hooking into some big fish if I do and be on the light stuff. So I might have another few casts and put this away. I should really just put it away, but it's pulling a bit of string. This is another nice penny. Bites are more frequent through here. Ooh, 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 behave yourself. Another nice snap. That's a good snap. Happy with that. For the yak. For the first mission on the yak. Come here. Behave yourself. Ah. Oh. Won't be fish of the morning, guys. So far, we plan on bloody getting a biggie though. Um, yeah, on the yak, can't complain with that. On the seven inch motor oil, behave yourself, please. <sighs> See you later, man. Cool. All right, I'll have another few casts with this because, because I'm a risk taker. Uh, <laughs> Chances are I'll have a couple of casts and I'll get fucking pumped, but it's all all fun and games of it, isn't it? Oh, it's getting windy through here, but that's all right. Sails out there. So yeah, around this area is usually where I like to fish when I'm out here in the boat. Um, haven't caught anything too crazy, but I haven't fished a lot to be honest, but do a bit of kingfish fishing through here and get a few snaps around that kind of six kg mark and things like that. myself out and something's taken my line and got me into the weeds. But yeah, the wind's just kind of gone a bit crazy. I don't think this was anything too big, but I uh, just must have hit that on the drop and take me through it in. I know he's not playing ball. Get him up. Whoa, gone. I think it was a cowboy anyway. There's bloody plenty of them through here. There we go, that's a bit of fish. Ooh. I don't think it's a cowboy. Oh, head on the drop. Now we're onto a bit of fish. Yeah. Oh. Not like a snap. Pull in a little bit of string. That's what we want. Finding a few fish through this little bit of an area. 
Here he comes. It's a nice snap. Oh, behave yourself. Come on up. Oh, he's got some dang dang. That's a nice snap. There we go. Oh. Oh, that wind's just been a bit of a spiarch. Oh, happy days. New PB for the kayak anyway. All right, I'll just um, I'll get out of the sun. Hold that one up. Oh, look at that. That's a nice fish. Happy as with that. And I'm not keeping anything. I'm letting them all go. Chill, bro. Chill. There, mate. Oh well, no pissing around, we'll see if we can get another one. Yeah, I um, uh, the thing I got from 7.30, I was like, oh. Oh, just oh. Just hooked a big fish. Oh, have you? Yeah. Just hooked your speaker and just like, put the phone down. I am on speaker. Oh. Ugh. It's pulling a bit of string and it's pulling the kayak out. Can you hear it? Oh. Well, it's not huge, but it's DC. Oh. Oh. It's hard to tell when it's pulling you around, but semi decent. Yeah. Pulling some drag. So, oh, come on, come on. What's that? Yeah. Oh, it's just splashing shit everywhere. Yeah, it's oh, it's probably like oh, six pound. I don't think my drags is as hot, hard, tight as I thought it was. Nice fish though. Oh, I mean, get in the kayak. Oh. I'll just hold this up for the camera. Sorry, team, I'm bloody chatting to the missus and filming. Oh, it's a good fish from the yak. Happy with that one. Really happy with that one. I'll just make sure there's no splashes on the camera. Yeah. Oh, it's a nice fish. I was just playing with it down there, just tapping it, and then I hit it, and then she was all on. Right in the lip. Right in the lip. That one wasn't getting off. I'll just uh, pull that out and let them go. On the coconut, oh no, on the bubble gum. It's a nice fish, happy as with that. See you, mate. Oh dear, why are you floating? Oh no, he's gone. everywhere today leave me alone here bird have this one here it's coming for you oh. eat it get it bird oh there's a kingy on it eat it kingy I dare you Oh god. Oh, where are you, kingfish? Right there. Come back. Eat it. Eat it. Eat him. Eat him. Go on. They're probably a bit small. Might get the kingy on the soft bait. Yeah, you're quite a bit cowboy, bro. That kingy is a bit kingy a bit small for you, bro. 
Leave me alone. Tell your mates. Snappers and kingies only. Here, bro. Here. No, no. Oh, shit. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let it go, you little gut's sake. Let it go. Jesus. Get out. Go on. Get. Get. Go catch your own fish. For I dong you. Nah, I won't dong you. Ooh, on. You there'd be snaps here. I reckon we could pull a DC one out of here too. Not far from the beach, so might put a bit of time in and just uh, work this little area and see if we can get a one bigger than the biggest one we got today, which was about five or six pounds. But a few fish to be had. And many a good fish have come out of this area in its day. More on a good day. Actually, I should probably keep a couple for the bin. So that one's coming home actually. It's a nice fish too. Oh, colours on him. Yeah, you're a perfect eater, mate. Behave, behave. Oh, look at that. That there is what I would say the perfect eater. So that one's coming home. Oh, come back. Another good penny, that's exactly what we're after. Another dinner fish, perfect. Oh, perfect dinnery. Look at that. Ah, oh, happy days. Or even lunch, could be lunch. Oh, it's a good fish. Straight off the first point that we started this morning. Had a few flicks here this morning and uh, got a few little nibs, but nothing. But yeah, happy with that. I obviously, those just broke in my wetsuit, but uh, yeah. Another nice penny. That one's coming home for. It'll either be lunch today or dinner. Behave yourself, mate. That's it, done team, done and dusted. Two nice panties for the bin, for lunch or for dinner tonight, and um, some good fish on the board out there. Plenty of fish too, nothing huge, but like, what was that? Five, six pound, happy with that, eh? Um, especially just for kayaking around, no sound or anything, and just, you know, plotting around. Unfortunately, I made the big boost back when the wind stopped. Well, I started to paddle back, and then the wind stopped halfway across. Then that bay I was in and wanted to fish was really nice, but, um, yeah, didn't get to fish that as much as I wanted to, but still really happy, eh? Um, we'll definitely get out and do this again in the kayak, and we'll take the kayak around and jump on the rocks and do some missions. But, um, yeah, if you've got any other suggestions for missions, just hit me up in the comments and let me know what you think I should be doing, and I'll uh, see if I can get out there and do it for you guys. Cheers for watching.